Hey everybody, it's Melanie here. Welcome to my Facebook Live. It's a couple minutes past eight here, Central Standard Time. And I chose the topic of goal setting. Um, this is something that I need to work on. And I actually um, listened to an audio today about the proper steps in goal setting and what you need to do and follow through with yourself. Um, to achieve what it is you're looking for. Um, so step number one is you need to write it down. You know, uh, what is it that you want to do and when do you want to have that done by? Um, so I wrote down some goals here. You guys hopefully can see that there, but um, let me flip it around here. Um, my goal one is to bring in 10 new business partners by this Sunday, April 9th, and to help those 10, goal number two is to help those 10 bring in 10 by April 29th. The reason I went out so far is because not everybody works at the same speed. Uh, life happens and, um, you know, sometimes people get distracted. But uh, that's what I'm working for. That's the kind of business that I am trying to build here. Um, the second step in your goal setting is to proclaim it to the world. So that's what I did. I'm here on Facebook Live telling you that this is what I'm going to do. This is what is happening in my business. Um, I'm going to add on 10 new business partners this week. And I'm going to help those 10 new business partners get their 10 or... Um, help 10 new people start a new life by April 29th. Um, some other things that I didn't write down is I have daily goals, and that's how many people I'm going to be talking to. Um, right now, I set my daily goal to talk to 80 people a day, um, share the information with them, and just be there to see, you know, is it a good fit for them? Is it not a good fit for them? I'm just a consultant. That's all I'm here for. Uh, a lot of people don't think that this is a, is for them and it's not their time. That's okay. Let me know. I'm fine with that. So we have write the goals down and proclaim it to the world. Step number three is you need to set up some sort of reward structure for yourself. So you need to decide when you're going to reward yourself. And you can reward yourself for little things. Um, some people that are uh, working on losing weight, I'm one of those people, uh, they will say, you know, I lost one and a half pounds this week or I've been doing good, so I am going to have a free day, not a cheat day, but a free day, and I'm going to eat whatever I would like that day. So, you know, we'll go out and have Domino's pizza or we'll go out and have Chinese food or something like that without overdoing it, you know, within reason. But um, you allow yourself those pleasures to, to kind of, you know, thank yourself, hey, I'm doing very well and this is my treat. Um, some other big things uh, like when you get to certain ranks in different businesses that you are in, you can say, hey, when I get to this rank, the husband and I are going to have a spa day or you're going to have a spa day with your girlfriends or um, if you're doing better, you're going to go on a certain vacation and, um, you know, those kind of things or you're going to buy a certain car, um, however you want to work it. And then... Step number four is you need to give yourself some sort of penalty if you do not reach that goal by the date that you said you're going to reach. And the most important part about this penalty is it needs to hurt. It, 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 it needs to be something that you are going to be mad at yourself about if you have to do. Um, one of the things that one of my mentors, Eric Worre, actually said in one of his videos was um, there is a like a um, accountability website. It's uh, stick.com. It's S-T, let's see, S-T-I-K-K dot com. Um, on there, you go and you set up an account and you can put in uh, credit card information and then you set up your goals the website has referees and they have uh, goal trackers and 
<laughs> you can put an amount in there like I'm going to lose, you know, $500. If I do not get to my goal by April 9th, $500 is going to go to something that I would hate to pay it to. So like an X or, um, he mentioned not to, not to get political, but he, he mentioned like, if you were a Democrat, it was going to go to the Republicans or vice versa, or, you know, a cause you don't really care about like Planned Parenthood or, or something like that. It has to be something where you're going to be like, heck no, that's not going to happen. I'm going to get my goal. We're going to do this thing. Uh, so that's stuff that I'm working on. I started writing down my goals, and I'm proclaiming them on Facebook to everybody. Um, you might see a few more in there because there's a couple other things I want to work on. But um, that is the proper goal setting that I have learned. I've watched a few different mentors speak about this, and they're basically the same thing. So step number one, write it down. If you don't write it down and you have it in your head, it's kind of like a, yeah, I'm going to do it maybe someday. Um, step number two, you need to proclaim it to the world. So whether that's you're standing in front of the mirror and you're saying, this is what I'm going to do and it's going to happen by this date, proclaim it to the universe, whatever. But you then have to hold yourself accountable for it. So get a reward structure. What are you going to do once you reach those goals? And then create some sort of penalty for when you don't reach those goals or if you don't reach those goals, because it really shouldn't be when you don't reach those goals, you should reach those goals and work your darndest to get there. Um, one last little bit of information is if you don't reach, if you don't reach a goal, put it on the list for the next, just keep extending it until you reach it, because that is something you want to do. And that's a step that you need to get past. Um, so there's a lot of people in the business who haven't reached a certain rank, well, when it gets to the time that they're looking for, or when it gets to the time that they were hoping they'd reach it, they just are saying, okay, I'm going to give myself another week. Let's do it, you know, work together. I'm going to work with my mentor. I'm going to work with the leaders in the team, get myself a strategy set up, and then hit the ground running. So <coughs> don't give up on yourself. Just keep going. Hey guys, thanks for watching and I will see you tomorrow. Bye-bye.